first and foremost, lovely to have you back in your speed. But trigger lots of memories coming back here. Yeah, even trying to remember where we sat in the dressing room was a bit of a challenge for some of us now. Uh, actually, really good fun, uh, really good energy about us. And nice to be back, even so meeting some of the fans on the way in was pretty cool. And remembering some, not remembering others, is, faces is, is key. So, no, good day and uh, looking forward to it. Obviously, it gives a reason why you guys have been invited back because what you achieved here is something that's, well, I'm sure everyone's reminded you, aren't they? Yeah, listen, it's obviously first and foremost about Reading in terms of 150 years, celebration. The uh, club has its good times, but also has its bad times that will, will stand the club in its good stead going forward. And, uh, good to be here, good to reminisce, I suppose, with, with the lads. and uh, I'm not too sure we're really dreading their, their team, to be honest with you. They all look still fit and and rare to go, so come forward. Yeah, no, a few people have travelled too far, hopefully not, not too far for you and the family to come today. Yeah, I think maybe I was going first to contact Bobby Convey to come because, yeah. thought, yeah. listen, 106 team, uh, it means a lot to everybody in terms of the memories they have. And uh, Nice for Bobby to come across, Marcus Ingemarsson. Good for Brynja that he misses out because he's got a job in Sweden now and I think he'll be a, a good manager going forward. And for him to get a job in Sweden, uh, it's a really key moment in his life as well, so that's good. So you mentioned those players and those names, special team, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, listen, who could have predicted Plymouth at home in the first game of the season? Uh, listen, I remember trying to sign me, they had to wait to sign a centre forward, we weren't very fashionable at the time, none of the players were, and we all made our name here, and we've, we've got ready to tank for that, and not the other way around. Uh, glad to be here and look forward to it. It'll never be beaten, I'll be in my grave, I think, and I'm still on the feet. So, it just in today's game as well, the game is falling all the time. It's pretty much impossible now to go a season in the Championship the way we did. So, I think we'll be there for a while, fingers crossed. And, uh, they are grandchildren and uh, great great grandchildren of Lefty, that team there. And, they don't really care, I've got two daughters, they don't even know they play football, so it is what it is. And they're here today actually, so it should be good fun. There's an opportunity reunion for all these players, so you know, it's not often you get a chance to come together, so but it's a good, as you said, reminiscing, touching base, catching up and all the rest of it. Yeah, the first one I've come into was Glenn Little, so I spent 15 minutes listening to him, talking, and then we got, we got in the stadium then, so listen, characters in the team was, was immense and uh, should be a good day.